We're standing here with a switchblade at uh, AirVenture 2019, and I'd like to go ahead and show you what this switchblade is all about. We started off 12 years ago wanting to know how do you make aviation more useful? How do you get flying to be an everyday or a common experience, something that's viable and something that can replace what we're doing now on the ground? So that's what started as the, how do you do that? And the answer was the switchblade. As we stand here today, we have the switchblade right here, capable of being stored in your garage. You drive out to your home airport, swing the wings and tail out, take off, fly to your destination, swing the wings back in again, and never being stopped on your travels. Take it with you wherever you want to go. For people who like to travel, this is especially by flight, if you want to incorporate that, this solves the problem of get their itis when, you know, you've you promised your Aunt Matilda that you're going to be there for Thanksgiving and doggone there's a weather front between you and her and it's a little bit dangerous. You really shouldn't fly but you're going to try and find your way there. So this takes that out because you can land right before the front, drive underneath and then continue flying out the backside. A lot of things are driving cross country. You might want to go on a trip but are you going to find aviation fuel everywhere you go where you want to land? Not every place. So with this you'd land drive into town, fill up at whatever gas station you want, come back to the airfield, keep going. Solves a lot, a lot of problems. We feel that safety is a big concern at Samson. That's what we're going for. So in our case, we have a full vehicle parachute for flying in case that's the only option left uh, in the air to get you down safely. Everything we've done so far, we're looking at whatever we can do to create this as a vehicle that covers all the different points to make it something that is safe for you to, to drive and fly. We've structurally tested the wings, structurally tested the boom and tail, structurally tested the landing gears. We've gone through fault mode testing, so all the different systems will go ahead and, and test to see, well, if this part of it fails, does the backup system kick in? Is there another backup system in case that one doesn't work? Those kinds of things get worked out until when we are done with this vehicle and out and ready for production, it's as good as we can make it ready for you. We're proud to be fulfilling that decades-long dream of a flying car that actually works for people. It's something that you can use to carry you where you want to go all the time, any day of the week.